G'day everyone, Mark Hunt back again on this channel, your Aussie culture expert for another Aussie culture video. And today I'm going to tell you what you have to do while you're in Australia. Whether you're an Aussie, a backpacker, or you're thinking of moving to the great AU, here's five things you have to do while you're in Australia. Number five. Go to a pub. The very first thing you should do after getting off your plane, your train or whatever, even before checking into your hotel, is going to an Aussie pub. Have a schooner, chat up the bartender, have a whirl at the pokies, play some Kino. It's a great way to get a feel for the local nightlife, make some friends, as well as meet some of the locals that you'll be in town with. Number four, have a barbecue. Whether you're the host or just an attendee, a barbecue's a great way to meet your neighbours, meet some of the local people, as well as try a classic Aussie staple, the steak and onion burger. You can also join in some classic Aussie backyard sports, pass a footy around, or try another great Aussie tradition, which is number three, play some backyard cricket. Whether you're mixing it up French styles, using a bloody wheelie bin for wickets, or completely abandoning the six and out rule, backyard cricket is a great way to get a taste of the Aussie sports culture. Everyone gets involved, we all take it just a little bit too seriously, but we all have fun. Unless everyone's related, in, in which case it's gonna turn to a shit fight and you should probably get out of there. Family and backyard cricket do not mix. Number two. Visit local attractions. This is a great way to support local pride as well as support some local businesses. But it's also going to reinforce the observation that Australia is a very beautiful and unique nation. And every town, no matter how small it is, is bound to have its own unique attraction. In fact, some attractions are so popular that other places try to steal them. Thinking of Bowen and it's big old mango. Additionally, talking to locals can get you better directions, give you travel tips, more importantly, probably just a great conversation. And number one, by far the most important thing you need to do while you're here in Australia, visit a Bunnings. Every city in Australia is bound to have a Bunnings in or near it. And I cannot recommend how great Bunnings is. If you're hungry, grab a famous Bunnings snag. Once you've done that, you can go look at bloody water features. Get sick of that? Go look at some garden plants. Get sick of that, go look at tools. Get sick of that, go look at power tools. Get sick of that, go look at bloody timber. And before you go home, you can pop into the Bunnings Cafe and get a coffee and a meal. It's just that bloody great. Bunnings is by far one of my favorite places to go ever. And when you go to one, you realize why. So if you're planning a trip to Australia anytime soon, make sure you do those five things. And if you're a local, you should have already done it. Remember, if you're ever driving by, don't be afraid to pop in and say hi. My name's Mark Hunt, Aussie culture expert. Thanks very much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Hooroo.